Hello Aries, welcome to your pyramid reading for March 10th through the 20th. Your rune is the rune of protection. That's always nice. We have our stone people card is otter medicine. Feminine energy and playfulness. Spirit animal ooh, is the raven, which is all about magic. Sign and symbol, ooh, is homecoming, meaning returning to who you truly are. Now, our pyramid set up here represents one step at a time, the work you need to do to get to your reward. So your first step is porcupine spirit, time for a beginner mind, time to go back to um, believing that all things are possible and having optimism, not worrying so much. Stone at this place is Dalmatian stone, which is all about the inner child, fortifies the spirit, playfulness, simple joy of being, healing and protective, especially with children and pets, helps you to manifest what you want in your life and also is known to help people stop smoking. Okay, our second step is, ooh, white raven spirit, trust in the magic. Look, you got two ravens. It's all about magic. Cool. Okay, and at this spot, your stone is angel aura quartz. Optimism, positivity, restores faith in humanity, reignites the inner child, and connects with the angels. Awesome. Okay, your next step is grasshopper spirit. Take a leap of faith. Your stone in this spot is Amazonite, the playmate. Fluidity, optimism, removes toxicity, helps with release, and is known as the hope stone. Okay, your next step, scarab beetle spirit. Magic, look at that, works through you. You've got a lot about magic, trust in the magic. The magic works through you. Your stone at this spot is Labradorite, which is kind of magical. Slayer of darkness, bringer of light. Helps you to direct energy. Seek out your purpose. Clears and protects the aura. And helps with transformation. Next step is starfish spirit be open to infinite possibility don't hold yourself back and our stone in this spot is desert rose which is perfect all things are possible go for your dreams without restraint and affirms your life purpose okay so let's kind of go over here Returning to a simpler state of mind, trusting in the magic, and then take a leap of faith, but don't hold yourself back. Be open to infinite possibility because magic works through you. And so our reward for all that work is a uh, cow spirit. The miracles are endless. Yes, they are. And our stone in this place is black gold stone. The light at the end of the tunnel. We are all part of the universe. Each of us a speck of light in the darkness. Awesome. Okay, that was wonderful reading. We're going to clarify with one card from our other deck. Sister Moon says, look at that. You are good enough. Animal Guardian. 
tells you to trust your instincts. And oh, we have the shawl, which is about returning home. It, this means the same thing. Returning to who you truly are. And let the magic begin. So your quote for this week is, trust the weight. Embrace the uncertainty. Enjoy the beauty of becoming. When nothing is certain, everything is possible. I hope you enjoyed your reading. Peace, love, and light. Until next time.